6.5 Creedmoor is an excellent cartridge for long ranges. Not only does it reach out far, it does so with great accuracy. Now many shooters who want to get the most out of this fine cartridge turn to hand loading it. This way they can control all factors and adapt it exactly to their rifle and their needs. That's all great and well, but not everybody wants to go that far. To get the best accuracy out of 6.5 Creedmoor, we've tested a lot of factory loads for you. The ones that impressed us the most, you find here. To determine which factory load gives you the best accuracy, we used five shot groups from a wide range of rifles. This way, we made sure that the achieved accuracy is really the result of the rounds fired and not just the gun. That being said, you should test the accuracy with your individual rifle to make sure that you do actually get the performance out of these rounds as we did. Number 5. Federal 6.5 Creedmoor 140 Grain Sierra Match King The 140 Grain Sierra Match King from Federal managed to shoot groups with a size of .501 inches as an average of 10 groups. While it's not surprising to get sub-MOA groups with a rifle chambered in 6.5 Creedmoor, it is great to see how tight they actually can go. For this ammo, the best guns were the Proof Tundra, Nozzer 21, Franchi Momentum Elite, and Accuracy International, ATX. The Proof Tundra managed groups with 3.59 inches. For the Nozzer 21, it was just .266 inches. For the Franchi Momentum Elite, the size of the group was .511 inches. And the Accuracy International ATX got .477 inches on paper. As you can see, this ammo is great for any rifle in 6.5 Creedmoor. This is not very surprising as the Sierra Match King comes with a good reputation, and a Federal is known as well for manufacturing of high-quality ammo. As this ammo manages such tight groups out of different rifles, you can use it for competition right as it is. You can easily win hunting-style matches, like the NRL Hunter Series, that makes it a lot easier for everyone who does not want to spend their afternoon reloading round after round for hours and hours, and then still have to clean up afterwards. Number 4, Hornady 143 grain ELDX. The Hornady 143 grain ELDX is one of the most accurate loads for hunting in 6.5 Creedmoor. It works well for elk, whitetails, mule deer, and antelope. Not only is the load very accurate, it also comes with a great terminal performance. At a distance of 600 yards, it still carries an energy of 1,157 foot pounds. Also, until this range, it drops an average 86 inches. Of course, you can also use it for distances greater than 600 yards. It is designed to hit with lower impact velocities. That leads to it losing a lot of its weight when it penetrates tissue if the velocity is too high. That's even more so when it hits at closer ranges where velocities are generally higher. The result is that it does not sail through the body, leaving holes on both sides. Instead, it stays inside the body of the animal that is by then dead anyway. With its unique ballistic tip, it also reduces the damage from air pressure. Actually, it's intended to be used past 400 yards. You get good expansion until the threshold of 1,600 feet per second. Typically, it falls below that somewhere between 8 and 900 yards. By then, it still has 800 foot-pounds of energy left. Compared to other 6.5 Creedmoor ammo, the ELDX does come with a ballistic coefficient that is slightly lower. That does not only increase the drop of the bullet, but makes it also a tad more susceptible to win. However, it's still very accurate, and getting sub-MOA groups out of it is not a challenge. The ballistic coefficient is still very high with 0.625. Keep in mind that everything over 0.600 is, well, wow, extremely high. Number 3, Hornady 147 grain ELDM. The Hornady 147 grain ELDM comes with a G1 ballistic coefficient of 0.697. That's as high as it can be nowadays. With it, you get 1,279 foot-pounds with a bullet drop of 84 inches at 600 yards. This makes it not only one of the most accurate, but also one of the flattest shooting cartridges of any caliber. There was one manufacturer that touted a higher ballistic coefficient, but then soon turned out to be inflated. Hornady achieved the performance of the ELDM of the bullet surface that does not deteriorate during flight. Instead, it stays uniform and consistent. Older bullets with an aluminum tip, for example, get marred if the air and lose performance. Besides the bullet, Hornady also delivers the most uniform brass that can be found on the market. Add to this, they're great primers and powder, which does not fluctuate very little because of temperature. That means at any temperature, you get close to the same performance. Not only is this ammo the first good shooters tend to take, but also is the benchmark of the 6.5 Creedmoor cartridge. The groups are super tight, and energy of the bullet is still high down range. While it was not designed with hunting in mind, it has been used for it and worked well. Inside the target, it tends to yaw, but does cause some penetration. 
Number two, the Nosler 140 grain RDF. The 140 grain RDF ammo from Nosler prints round as tight as .510 inches as a 10 group average. Long range shooting is a game of thousands of an inch, so you can see how a round with such tight group serves you well when you need the best accuracy achievable. In reality, when it comes to the size of this group, you're fighting over differences that are literally splitting hairs. For the Nosler ammo, the smallest groups were achieved with one rifle, the Accuracy International ATX. Here, the best groups were between .347 and .497 inches. This means you need to make sure with this rifle how it really behaves when fired from your individual gun. Of course, that really matters only in matches when you go up against the finest of the finest the shooting world has to offer. For everything else, this round is just more accurate than the average shooter will ever manage. Going for different rifles, you get slightly larger groups. For the Proof Tundra, it is .506 inches. For the Franchi Momentum Elite, it is .536 inches. That are very good results, but you need to make sure with your specific rifle. The RDF bullet line has also more to offer. That starts with 70 grain in the caliber of 224 and reaches a bullet weight of 300 grains for the 338 caliber. Nosler created this line as its own in house offer precision rifle projectiles. The full meaning of RDF is reduced drag factor. You get a ballistic coefficient as high as possible from these bullets thanks to their compound O gives and long boat tails. Overall, when you compare that it's used in the shooting world, you might be surprised to hear that RDFs are not necessarily that known or popular. Berger and Hornady offer bullets that soak up most of the attention, but there are more and more top-class shooters winning thanks to RDF projectiles. With their performance, RDF bullets will not stay unknown for long. They have a long and successful life ahead of them. Number 1. Norma Bond Strike Extreme 143 grain. The Norma Bond Strike Extreme is a solid choice when you want to go hunting at longer ranges. It's very accurate and gets you a good performance. 600 yards is still punches with 1,203 foot-pounds while dropping 83 inches. Norma itself is known for its accurate and high-quality loads and are also very reliable. The ballistic coefficient is .629, enough for it to play in the category of long-range cartridges. The focus of Norma is a well-rounded bullet that comes with a bonded jacket that's quite sturdy. While the jacket's rather thin at the front, it is bonded well to the lead core. Thanks to this, it retains its weight, enabling it to penetrate very deep. That the jacket is rather thin at the tip helps with expansion, even when the velocity is already dropped. It is a popular choice for longer ranges, but it's also made for high-end rifles. And there you have it, guys. The 6.5 Creedmoor factory loads that get you the best accuracy. If you think there's another one out there that we've forgotten, well, feel free to put it into the comments. Don't forget to tell us why you think it is one of the best.